If you've got a small YouTube channel and you're looking for easy ways to make significant income with it, then affiliate marketing is the answer. But a lot of people don't know how to start or even where to start when you're looking for affiliate programs. So in this video, I'm going to show you three ways to find the best affiliate programs for you to join and promote on your specific channel. Let's roll. Hey, Digital Trailblazers. This is Leah Ray from digitaltrailblazer.com. Welcome to our channel. If you want to use YouTube to grow your business, drive traffic, convert sales, then you are in the right place. So subscribe. Now I've got three ways to show you how to find great affiliate programs to join. And when you learn all three of these, you'll see that you actually have a ton of options open to you. So we're going to show you how to evaluate the terms of each program and to pick the one that really fits best for you. But the first tactic, which is kind of going to be a little obvious is to check and see what products and services are you already using that have affiliate programs. Now those are really the best programs to join and to promote because you can legitimately give an honest review and an honest recommendation. Now sometimes companies have links to their affiliate programs directly on their website, but other times you just have to do a Google search in order to find it. Just type in the name of the company and quote affiliate program. For example, quote squatty potty affiliate program or quote Canon affiliate program. Now you might be surprised that the things you've already been mentioning and recommending to people on YouTube have affiliate programs. For example, Canon is a company that sells products directly on its website and they have an affiliate program. So if you're recommending any of their cameras their lenses, printers, or other products, it's not too hard just to sign up as an affiliate for their program and start getting paid for your recommendations. Number two, find an online store that sells a product or service that you use and see if they have an affiliate program. Now, sometimes the products that you use aren't available directly from the manufacturer, or they may be available for a cheaper price from other online stores. For example, taste of the wild dog food isn't sold on the manufacturer's website and they don't have an affiliate program, but many of the stores that sell it do have an affiliate program like Amazon, Chewy.com, Petco, 100 pet meds and others. Now here is a pro tip. When you have multiple options, you will want to look very carefully at what the terms of the different affiliate programs are because they can be very different between the different companies. For example, Amazon's affiliate program only gives you a 24 hour referral window. So once someone clicks on your affiliate link, they need to buy that product within 24 hours in order for you to get credit for the sale. But the good news is that you get credit for really anything that they buy on Amazon during that 24 hours. So even if they don't end up buying the product that you recommended to them and they do go on to buy something else like an HDTV or something like that, you will actually get an affiliate commission on that. Now compare that to a website like Chewy.com. They give you a 15 day referral window, which is great, but the way you get paid is also different. So Chewy.com only pays you when you refer a new customer and they give you a flat $15 commission for every new customer that you refer. So it could be much more profitable than something like Amazon if you're always referring new customers. So if you're a search heavy channel and you get a lot of new people seeing your content, might be a good idea. But on the flip side, you don't get credit for returning customers or repeat buyers. So over the long run, it might not be such a good deal for you depending on your audience. So if you've got multiple options, carefully check and compare things like the referral window, the commission rate, and the other terms of each affiliate program to make sure that you join the one that suits you best. Now, the third way to find affiliate programs is that if you're looking for something new to promote, one way to find new opportunities is to see what other people are promoting. So doing a search on Google or on YouTube for best blank. So best nonstick frying pan or best uh, photography lighting kit or whatever. <laughs> we'll give you a bunch of ideas of what others are recommending and help you find new products and companies to review and promote. Now, for example, if we do a search for best dog food subscriptions, here is an article that gives us 16 different suggestions. Now, honestly, I wouldn't recommend making a video like this because we personally don't recommend things that we haven't already used ourselves at some point. And whoever wrote this article obviously hasn't tried all of the dog food subscriptions they're recommending. They just basically compiled a list list of the different dog food subscriptions, signed up as an affiliate for as many of them as they could, and then they wrote a little article about it. <laughs> now, we don't do that because we want our recommendations to be authentic and actually mean something. But 
In any case, most of these dog food subscriptions have an affiliate plan. You can tell by the link they're sending you to. If you look at the URL, you'll see something like um, AFF track or sub ID. These are tags added to the end of a URL that help track the clicks on the affiliate links and sales. So when you see that, it's a quick way of figuring out if a store they're sending you to has an affiliate program that you could also join. Now, when you're looking for new affiliate programs, try to think outside the box a little bit. Physical products are an easy thing to do, but they're often the lowest paying offers that you can promote, typically only four to 7% per sale on a physical product. But if you find a software program, an online app or a digital product or a digital training course, those will often pay 20% up to 50% or more. A lot of times you can find relevant digital products on websites like Udemy, JVZoo and ClickBank. So that may be a great place to start. But our recommendation is to always buy the product first and try it out yourself so you can give an honest review and an honest recommendation. Because let's be real, some things on there kind of suck while others are fabulous. Now, if you want to learn more about how to increase the amount you earn through affiliate marketing, you want to watch this video next up a rock on your screen, top link in the description. I'll see you there. Take care.